guys, welcome back to um, a video I haven't, well, the videos that I haven't done in a while actually. Um, I haven't done the daily life videos for a little while, so I did them about a week or two ago, so it's been a little while. Just make sure you come and subscribe, don't forget to turn on notifications, so even like the comment and question, don't subscribe. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook and Twitch and TikTok. <laughs> Links all down below in the description. So, my daily life stuff. Okay, how well can I start with this one? Because it's been, as I said, it's been a few weeks since I last done one. Um, right. Um, I suppose one of the things I want to mention in this particular, these two parts particularly, because the last one I'm going to be doing some running of locomotives on the layout. Um, how do I start this one? Um, Thing. Well, there is some. If you heard about China with the virus thing that's going around, apparently someone in the UK has already picked it up. Um, <clears throat> it's not serious over here at the moment, but only time will tell if it decides to spread. But, um, yeah, um, What am I going to say? As I said, I have got something brand new. I got something, um, my new daily life stuff is coming up during the summertime. Um, around June sometime actually, my um, big special stuff is coming up. Um, so for this video, I'm talking about how the um, start of my well, my start of some new things coming in summer in July. Um, in July, it's going to be my diet and stuff, so it's going to make a start on July. Um, which should be a good start before I go away for three or four days, basically on holiday in September. Um, it'll probably be the end of August, thinking in September sometime, but... Um, <clears throat> I think definitely... I think definitely sometime in that time when I've got some time away I'll do some videos still with you but the videos will be a little bit different obviously because I won't be bringing the tripod, I'll just bring the camera and obviously my phone and my laptop obviously because I can't upload the content out the computer so as in I upload my content every day anyway so um, we did go for a walk today, it didn't tend to, didn't use all that much of it. Um, obviously we are limited on mileage and petrol at the moment because, as I said, I've seen my dream car one, because you need know how to save up for it from the second one, because it's uh, Mercedes-Benz 1995 automatic petrol. Mercedes Benz car, and yeah, I'm looking to save up for one of them as my second car, not my first. Uh, my first car will be a, a smart car manual, I think, because I think if I just at least pass my test in a manual, it means I get an option to drive both. If at least in a manual, only get drive only automatics, and I prefer if at least I pass my test in a manual would mean I have the option of both while I'm still by it because potentially because my, my second car will be an automatic anyway but the first car won't be um, I just want to basically have a f five or six years experience with manual first before I end up driving automatics for the rest of my life yeah I think So yes, 
that is going to happen at some point. My 40th birthday when it comes around eventually. Um, that would be my second card to buy. So I don't know if Casey and Pamela want to be involved when I get my second car. They probably want to be involved with both of them. Um, but we'll wait and see. Um, Because obviously I have to go up country probably to get my second one because it's quite an old car and obviously getting a, a automatic Mercedes 1995 it's in the old sport package of 95 the year I was born basically um, in Mercedes Benz automatic petrol um, power steering it's got all the cook and burial basically the early basics of it but um, I'm going to do all the I'm going to do it all up eventually basically it's going to have LED headlights eventually on it or have new twin exhaust downlets on it um, basically it will just have some new bits part fitted to it because basically doing it up for the modern daytime um, it will probably have a miniature spoiler if I had one on there not a big one like you see on some younger guys cars I will only have a small one because I wouldn't want to have something so big as you can't see the back of you. Um, just something small it just sort of sits on the back of the boot or something. And it's not too in your face basically which would be nice. Um, tinted windows definitely might be an option if I can do that. I'm not going to do analog oils. I know some people do but I'm not one to do that. Um, but yeah, as I said, my daily life stuff is coming more to come in, in the summertime not quite in summer holidays but just before um, the summer holiday starts in the summer holidays it's going to end up being mostly train stuff because it's going to be warm it's going to be sunny I might even do some couple of trains outside in the summertime because it's warmer and sunny usually this year might not be it might be just be cold and miserable <laughs> oh I know um, So yes guys, I have my other life I've got to bring out to you for the second part if I can remember it. Um, the because it would be just funny if we meet up with Moon again at some point in life. Because we just bumped into each other somewhere. It could happen. It's pretty unlikely but it could happen. And I said if it happens, it happens, but if it doesn't, it doesn't, you know, it's the sort of thing um, sometimes you sort of bump into someone you used to knew I was thinking maybe I was going to bump into Louise from school, but I think I felt like I did at one point when you know, we went to the New Key Swimming Pool area um, a couple of years now we went there, and basically we saw this lady who looked very much looked like Louise at school and I was thinking she kept looking at me like I was, she looks like she knew me or something. It was just kind of funny, I was like, is that the way he was next to me? He was like, because I had, the, I had an, a, um, a, you know, one was called Amy and the other one called Bethany, I was thinking, hang on, that sounds familiar. I was thinking, okay, that's definitely, looks like, I was like, I guess walking away and didn't know what to do. And apparently Louise's, Louise's male friend's family used to be down in Cambridge area in Governor's to where the place was aimed. Um, apparently occasionally these would come down and come off on a holiday, go to the New Kids Wayne Point area. So I wouldn't be surprised if it was her at the time. <laughs> and I just didn't say anything. There was a high possibility it could have been her. Because I wasn't going to say anything just in case it's on one. But, um, that to side, um, yes, yeah, so July, I'm starting doing my diet thing in July because in July it's easier because it's warm, it's, you know, most people just start eating healthy things by June or July because, you know, salads start coming out and things like that. So, I'll start looking into that sort of an option in summer. Um, sugary drinks. I'm not going to start too much about the sugary drinks for this year, but 
the food one at least it will start this year but the drinks we'll probably do next year or a couple of years down the line but the food one will at least be as the first one I'll take the party first How, how's the Oh yeah, my toe is still under um, relevant of um, being getting better. It takes a while, but it means that at that time, while it's still repairing itself, basically after the damage.